Hi, I'm Nathan. You may know me as MM102, or you just don't know me. Last year at C3, I made a video about my player creation kit for Super Mario World. While useful, its biggest flaw is you had to cut and paste everything manually once you're done. Wouldn't it be nice if we could just turn this sheet into binary files in just one click? Yeah, like that'll happen. Introducing version 2 of my character creation sheet, which comes with the new Ace Bray script that will pack everything automatically for you. The sheet itself is mostly the same with the biggest change being in the upper right hand corner. It now contains reference to the original palette as well as one marked Your Palette. Editing this palette is very important because it will now be used when exporting your character. The overworld palette now has all 16 entries in case you want to have a 16 color overworld character. All normal caveats from the first video still apply with this sheet. To install the script, go to File, Scripts, Open Script Folder. From there, copy the Super Mario World Character Packer folder into your Scripts folder. To activate the script, again go to File, Scripts, Super Mario World Character Packer. If you don't see it, press the Rescan Scripts Folder button. If you're going to be using this often, I recommend binding a hotkey in your keyboard preferences. Usage is pretty straightforward. Just select the files you want to create and press export. By default, the destination folder is set to wherever your character packer is saved to. Upon export, you may be asked by a spray if you want the script to access certain files. Just click yes. This script tends to access a lot of files, so if you want to get rid of these pop-ups, press this button to trust the script. Once finished, you should have fully functioning graphic files to use with Super Mario World. Hopefully, you find this tool useful. At the moment, the exporter is limited to an Acebrite script, meaning you'll need Acebrite to take advantage of this. If you don't have Acebrite, you can still follow the method in the first video, which I recommend watching anyways because it better explains how to use the sheet. But wait, if you can export player graphics using Acebrite, what's stopping you from doing this with other graphics files? Well, this video has a sister video talking about just that, so be sure to check it out. Thanks for watching.